This textbook divides the skill of finding the main idea into um, four or five small uh, steps. And this is the first in the series of steps to teach you how to f identify a main idea. Um, we're going to keep it really simple uh, for, for the first step and just talk about the concept of general versus specific. General is a big idea, specific is a very narrow or, or focused idea. And this exercise in your book on page 60 asks you to identify one general idea and the three specific ideas that support it. As in this example, um, the general idea is pets and three supporting ideas are dogs, goldfish, and hamsters. Now let's take a look. I'll help you get started on this exercise. Um, in the number one, home cooking, takeout, ways to eat dinner, and frozen foods. Um, what is the general idea? The general idea is like the umbrella, as I mentioned in the lecture on main ideas, and the supporting details fit under the umbrella. So in number one, um, no, ways to eat dinner is general, and home cooking, takeout, and frozen foods are really specific. Those are details that are different ways to eat dinner. Number two, um, you can say that weather forecasts is the general idea, the really big idea, and hot and humid, cold and rainy, and cloudy with scattered showers are specific um, uh, details that fall under this general umbrella idea of weather forecasts. Uh, number three, um, as you might guess, the general idea is bad habits and uh, supporting um, specific uh, details are oversleeping, overeating, and smoking. So go ahead and try the rest of these um, on your own.